probably the next two or three weeks, we will be very busy. This path is too rocky to blaze a new trail, too dry to I leave a mark. Like this June has probably been the hottest June I've experienced here. Park Superintendent Jeff Davis and retail manager Paul Baker say it hasn't rained here since May. This is the ballroom track site. Usually, a drought is bad for business. But there's a big butt to that, yeah. Emerge from the dehydrated path to find something new. Wow. At Dinosaur Valley State Park. This is so cool. 110 million years young. Normally you see about a quarter of this. The Paluxy River's retreat has created a once in a lifetime. You see this guy stepping right here. Boom, boom. Maybe once in an eon opportunity. There's a good chance we may find another track around in here. Clear the dried sediment. Maybe one right there. And unearth something. Yep. Jurassic. Yep, there you go. That's for track. Never before seen sauropod and theropod tracks. Look at that big print. Preserved an eternity ago when dirt and rocks gently filled in the mud hole. And then more and more layers built up. And it was buried for most of geologic time, over 100 million years, until in 1908, a big flood came through and lifted off the overlying layers. There's probably 400 unearthed prints here at the so-called ballroom site. The mud has been all pushed up around it. Though the dinos dance was far from elegant. They're stepping on each other, running around. Volunteers like Philip Scoggins. You get right, left. And Glenn Cuban. Right. Are here. racing against a natural here. clock. And there trying to map and mold these tracks. Yep, that's the last one before he heads under the gravel there. Before the next good rain replenishes the Paluxy. Oh my goodness, look at the. Until then. That's a baby dinosaur. No, that's not a baby dinosaur, that's a big dinosaur. The dry riverbed is a siren for childlike wonder. Dinosaurs used to walk right through here. Every depression. Right where you're standing. A perfect fit for tiny shoes. Look at that big footprint. Imprinting memories. Isn't that neat? As they step through time. What's this over here? In Glenrose. Yeah, that's a big one. I'm Matt Houston.